Well, good afternoon. How are you doing today? Uh, thank you all for tuning in. I really appreciate it. We're going to catch up on a few things right quick before we get out of here. Um, uh, according to sources in Delaware, Biden did not win Delaware. Uh, there was 20,000 pieces of paper that had to do with the, pickle, the people picking process, not the pickle peeping process, because we don't want to peep at people's pickers because we want to pick people. Now do that. All right. Anyhow, check that. Uh, those those 20,000 pieces of paper were uh, mostly out of uh, old folks' homes, rest homes, people's, uh, like, you know, re old rehab facilities for, you know, people, where uh, a lot of these uh, people, pieces of people, uh, paper were uh, supposed to come out of. And what's even more suspicious about it is that a lot of these pieces of paper came from, there were that many beds. There's not that many beds in these homes. So that means that, uh, you know, that's just weird how they had a 100% turnout. Uh, the, 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 the tallies registered more than the beds that were in the homes. Um, and looks like 25% of those pieces of paper out of those, um, of, um, of, uh, mail-in pieces of paper in Delaware were adjudicated by a human being, which means there was a human that seen the pieces of paper used to choose what was going on, decided whether or not who and what was going to be doing what they needed to do, but by these pieces of paper used to choose the choosing process. Big code words today. Trying hard. So 25% of those were that way. And according to state law, anything over 0008, 0008, okay, three zeros, three, uh, 008, anything after that has to be adjudicated or has to be looked over by both a Democrat and a Republican. It has to be uh, uh, also looked at by an election judge. I know that's a bit of a process. People are going to say it was hard to do because of all the extra pieces of paper that were coming in due to the whole process being different. But the process didn't take place. And they did allow extra time for these people pickers to come in through weeks. They're counting these things all week. So they should have had time to been able to actually really look these things over. So that was that shows something that happened right there. Uh, now this is all happening in Delaware. So there's stuff going on. Stuff is happening. Um, we've got a lot of things taking place also on our side. we got people trying to infight each other, man. That is not going to do any good. We don't need to be going off on Karen Fan or, or anybody of that nature because, you know, um, this went further than anybody ever expected. They expected that people picking process checking thing to never even take place. That means that a lot of uncharted territories are taking place with these people. And, you know, things don't move as fast as some people want them to. So they're going to immediately start attacking these people. And I know when people do that to me, for whatever reason, it really makes me unmotivated. It kind of wants me to get away from the whole thing. You know, just distance yourself. So positive reinforcement. Thank these people for what they're doing. So when this starts, if we can, you know, we've got to get this domino to completely fall. We've got to see this all the way through. Don't want... You mess this up. So, you know, show love to people that are doing, you know, all the people who were involved with the people picking process, you know, doing all they can do. Send these people emails of love. Let them know that we're, we appreciate what they do. Stop in fighting with each other. We got to come together. We got to hold our hands, get in the line, jump in the water. Otherwise, nobody's going to swim. Uh, you know, another good sign of that is, you know, Gail Golick is going to be campaigning against Karen Fan, and they're always wanting. Kelly Townsend to say something negative about Kelly, about by Karen Fan, and she's not going to do it because they are in the same party with each other. That means that they're going to work together, not going to be separating and calling each other names. They're going to come together, and they want that's you know basically what it takes to win this is to come together. We've got to put aside our differences. We cannot uh, just we can't be just nitpicking on every little thing and everything be perfect for you. You've got to. Everybody's got to kind of find a, an idea, go together, work with it. And so to complete the rest of this process that's been done, support needs to be done. We need to rally for these people. We need to go out there and say, we appreciate what you do. Please don't stop. Uh, you know, take the time that you need, you know, just, you know, and, and I'm pretty sure that we'll get a lot further than just it going out from under the bridge because people don't want to do anything with it because other states and other counties and other areas see how people get attacked when things don't go right. Nobody's going to want to get involved. Uh, 
So that means that we've got to come together. That's my main message out of this whole thing. I know that what happened in Delaware is bad, but if anything's going to take place, we've got to stick together. Um, let's see here. Uh, let's see, that's, that covers that. I just really want to thank everybody for tuning in. It's been wonderful. I want to thank all my new subscribers. Um, all the fun things that we're going to be getting into. I'm working on an old Toyota today. It's uh, I've got to pull the cylinder head off. It, it's been ran hot, the poor old thing. I get a lot of that kind of work. And this old Ford right here, this old 93, she's a nice old truck, but that sucker gave me a rough time too. <laughs> Air intake temperature sensor for any gearheads out there can really, can yeah, that thing, yeah. Anyhow, thank you all very, very much. And I'll be bringing some more videos. Thank you everybody for tuning in and thank all the help and support from everybody that I got. But one thing is for sure, this is all part of God's plan, and we have to come together. We got If we want to make this happen, we've got to come together. We've got to stick together. We can't be infighting, and praise these people who are helping us. Thank you. Bye-bye.